Hello Virgo and welcome to my channel Love and Wonders Tarot. This is your About Last Night reading where I take a look at your romantic situation and try to determine what's going on. Today I'm using the uh, Tarot Grand Lux Tarot deck along with the Good Tarot Tarot deck. And as you can see, I've already meditated, shuffled and pulled your cards. All of my cards are red in the upright position. So let's get started, Virgo. Okay, Virgo, today we're gonna look at the overall energy of your situation with this person. And I also have an advice card or an action card for you here. So we're gonna look at the overall situation for you and this person, and it's the Seven of Water, the same as the Seven of Cups. So as you can see on this card, this person here is looking around. This person has many choices, and this person does not know which one to choose because there's so many to choose. They're all very tempting and beautiful. So to me, this is saying, um, Virgo, that you have you know, choices maybe in uh, love. Maybe you're dating around. Maybe you have many suitors, okay? So um, with this person, though, your person is showing up as the Page of Cups. So while you have many suitors, I feel like one of those suitors is this Page of Cups who's kind of like, you know, if you know one of them that's kind of like on the shyer side, that's this person. This person's kind of shy. This person like fantasizes about you. Um, you may have gone on a date or two with this person um, and this person really likes you. Okay, this person has a major crush on you, but I do feel like you have had interactions with this person, and this person could be younger than you. Your person right now is showing up also with the energy of the Ten of Swords, so your person is very hurt. They feel betrayed. They feel backstabbed. So did this person think that they were going to be in a committed connection with you? Did this person find out that you have other did they find out that you have other people that you're dating around? For some reason, this person feels very devastated, okay? And again, remember, this is kind of like a shy person, and this person really, really likes you. Um, this next row represents your person's intentions. So their intentions was to be in a connection, in a relationship with you. They wanted to start something new. They thought that uh, you two would be together. So this is the Ace of Coins, the same as the Ace of Pentacles. So their intentions still are to be in a relationship with you. This is the person, or that you are the person that this person feels like they want to start um a new beginning with they want they feel like that this connection could last a long time they feel like you are a very good pop a potential that the connection with you has a lot of potential and basically to keep it short this person wants to start a relationship with you they want to start over brand new and their intention is to not give up they do have the death card so this is about something ending and then um restarting so i feel like first of all with the death card this person doesn't want to let go you know no one wants to die so this person doesn't want this connection to die and the death card is also about um rebirth okay letting go of one thing so something else could start so maybe this person feels like okay although you ended this connection with them um they're going to continue to try to build on it. Again, this person wants a relationship with you, a real relationship with you. Maybe this person wants you to settle down with them. You know, maybe they want um, you to make them your choice. Okay, remember you do have choices. So they wanna be your choice. This person is going to try to renew this connection. Okay, or get you to settle down with them. What's blocking this um, connection, This these two cards represent what's blocking the connections, the Queen of Cups. So there's no compassion. The Queen of Cups is um, a loyal person, a compassionate, um, takes care of the family, everyone. So I feel if that, that's what's lacking, you're not really interested in having that with this particular person. You are lacking compassion. That's what's blocking this connection. Also what's blocking this connection is temperance. So this is about being patient um, and um, having a display moderation. So I feel like you're pulling back, you know, you're kind of cooling off, uh, backing away from this person. This is also, temperance is also about, about turning something into something else, okay? So um, on the traditional card, you can see that there's a person pouring water into fire to create something else, okay? So I feel like as a block, this is saying that you do not want to create something with this person, okay? So those are your blocks. 
there's no uh, compassion for this person, there's no passion for this person, and you do not want to create anything with this person. You don't want to be in a connection with this person. So um, I'm not sure if you came across this channel to, you know, find out about someone else, but the person that showed up in this reading is this Page of Cups. This person who is fantasizing about you, this person that you know, you've been around this person, you've probably gone on a date with this person. If not, at minimum, you do know this person. This person has a major crush on you. This person daydreams about you. This person wants to be with you, wants to be in a relationship with you, but they feel devastated because they probably got wind that you are dating other people, okay? You have other choices. You're not ready to settle down. The action needed from you or the advice card is the Four of Water, which is the same as the Four of Cups. So the Four of Cups is about, you know, knowing that you have other options. So I feel like in the advice position, this is saying explore your other options. You know, um, if this person is talking to you, don't let this person make you feel guilty. Yes, you do have many choices. And this is about exploring all the choices that you have available to you. So again, I'm thinking maybe you came across this reading because you wanted to find out about someone else, but you ended up finding, up, finding out about this page of cups. All right, so, oh, the bottom of the deck for your person is the eight of coins or the same as the eight of pentacles. So that's about working on a relationship, trying to work on it, trying to figure out what um, he or she needs to do to make things better. So this person, again, like I said, they're not willing to give up with this death card. They don't want to let go and they're going to continue to work on it, okay? They're going to continue to approach you and try to date you and all that good stuff. Um, the bottom of the deck for you is the uh, sun card. So this is about, you know, doing whatever makes you happy, okay? Do whatever makes you happy. So that's what I'm seeing, Virgo. Uh, you have someone out there who has a big crush on you and this person has intentions on being with you, but you're not interested in this particular person. So that's what I'm seeing. Good luck with the situation. Thank you for stopping by and watching my video and have a wonderful day.